The Center for Internet and Technology Addiction collaborated with AT&T to find out the nature of compulsive smartphone use and particularly the use of the smartphone for texting while driving. Although people know it's dangerous while driving, they still do it. People compulsively check their phones because every time they get an update through social media, through email, through text, they experience an elevation of dopamine, which is a neurochemical in the brain. That elevation of dopamine is experienced as a form of pleasure. So what happens is, because this ability to find these desirable pieces of information are variable in terms of when and where, the brain experiences it much like a slot machine. And that's what compels the brain to keep searching for it. Compulsive smartphone use can really create problems in people's lives but it really gets dangerous when people get behind the wheel. So one of the things that we have to do, first above all, is publicly educate people. The other thing is to teach people techniques to manage their smartphone use in new ways, and one of those are applications such as ATT's drive mode. 82% of people feel better about themselves when they begin to take steps to limit their texting while driving. Learning to change a behavior starts incrementally, just by the awareness that something has to change, and over time leading to the elimination of texting and driving.